Not over. You no. just started. I wish. Why can't we win those jacks? Jack highs. Maybe we should stop playing jack high. That is not not really that good aim. Decent holdings for Nowak. Call. Just a call on the button with the royal family. All in. Raise all in. And that has enticed Lingren into an all in. It's an abandoned ship, and Noak's body language does not look like somebody who is going to make this call. Very reluctantly. Wow. Well, at least that made my hand worse. Classic squeeze play move there from Eric Lindgren. Oh, you had a king? Obviously not two. Didn't have ace king. A battle royal developing here between these four players in the poker lounge in association with Full Tilt Poker. Rocky Ross Boatman with a pocket pair under the gun. Raised to 4,500. We raised 10,100. Pass. 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 Boatman began the hand with $21,000, so he's pretty much committing himself if he puts any more money in the pot here. It's a decision pot for the Hendon mobster. All in. I call. Raise all in and call. Your pair? Off to the races. Rosalind with pair fives, playing against ace of clubs, queen of spades from Theo. Uh. Here comes four, ace, <laughs> ace. <laughs> races for Theo. Five, huh? The deuce. Oh, I would have had a house. Rosalind no. five, or it's Maybe right, it's right. But that six means Boatman's out. Right. Good luck, boys. Hard luck. Thank you. Nice play with you. He leaves the table in fourth place, not bothering with the handshakes. Theo Jorgensen's hands are too busy anyway, stacking up his chips. So we're down to three. Jorgensen just ahead of Lindgren, but Noak still hanging in there. And the Dane has found yet another ace suited this time. Uh, 
Or raised to 4,500. <clears throat> Axel Noack considering an all-in push, perhaps. Pass. 13. We raised to 13,000. Incredibly, the two chip leaders are all in pre-flop. Eric, all in with ace king, is a diamonds king of spades. He holds ace, eight of hearts. Let's see the flop, please. Up comes six king, king with wow. two hearts. That's a fine flop. <laughs> I saw the king first, it just got worse. The Queen of Clubs. Another heart, and Lindgren will be sent packing. Ten of diamonds, and Eric doubles up. 43-5. E-Dog, now very much the big dog. 30-36 that plus that's 75. 43-5. Oh, a monster is born. That's what my mother always said. <laughs> 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 so, Eric Lindgren, with over $80,000 now, he has to be a big favourite to take this home. Fold. Call. Sorry. Axel Noack laying a trap here with the Ace King. More. And it's worked. Noak has him dominated as the cards go over. Excel all in. Excel all in hand is eighth king. Nice. And uh, Eric's hand is king jack. Trey, queen, tray. No change on the flop. Ace. Pair of aces for Noak. Only a ten would knock him out. But he makes two pairs on the river. And that means that Axel Noack, originally from Germany, now living in Ireland, a wise choice, mine hair, has survived yet another all in situation. And he stacks his chips and is beginning to get an aura of invincibility. <sighs> so a tremendous battle developing between these three here in the poker lounge in association with full tilt poker. Jorgensen finds another ace on the button. Fold. And curiously decides not to go to war with it. Perhaps he picks something up from the body language of the German. Call. Noak calls with his ace, and we're going to see a flop. And what a flop for Noak. He's got top pair, top kicker, and the nut flush draw. Bet 2,000. And Lindgren bets with just a gut shot straight draw. Best hand, but how's he going to play it? Check. Ten. 
but 5,000. Lindgren is on a complete bluff. No, I have to call her. Call. You win. You sure? Don't yeah. mark it. <laughs> I'm positive. A heavy sigh from Lindgren, but Axel Noax's climb to the summit continues. 